Scientists are puzzled by a big patch of unusually cold water in the North Atlantic, just south of Greenland. This North Atlantic cold anomaly, or cold blob, is much colder than average, even as most oceans are warming. It stands out on temperature maps and could have major impacts on our climate system. The ocean acts as Earth's weather engine, moving heat around the globe. When a part of that engine changes, like this cold patch, it can trigger ripple effects across continents. The likely cause? A slowdown in a massive ocean current system that usually brings warm water north. Less warm water means the region cools, creating the anomaly. This cold blob could shape the winter of 2025 to 2026 for North America, affecting everything from blizzards to mild spells. Understanding this anomaly is key for long-range forecasts. Let's dive in to see what this chilly patch could mean for the months ahead. To understand the mysterious cold blob in the North Atlantic, we first need to talk about a powerful force shaping our planet's climate, the Atlantic Meridional Overturning Circulation, or AMOC for short. This system is one of the most important and complex components of Earth's climate engine. Imagine the AMOC as a massive conveyor belt stretching across the Atlantic Ocean. It moves warm, salty water from the tropics all the way northward toward Europe and the Arctic. This journey is not just a simple flow, it's a continuous, looping process that connects distant parts of the ocean. Thanks to this oceanic conveyor belt, Western Europe enjoys winters that are much milder than other regions at similar latitudes. Cities like London and Paris are far warmer in winter than, say, parts of Canada at the same distance from the equator. As the warm water travels north, it gradually cools down and becomes saltier due to evaporation. Near Greenland and Iceland, this now cold salty water grows dense enough to sink deep into the ocean, plunging toward the seafloor. This sinking action is the engine that powers the entire AMOC. As the dense water sinks, it pulls more warm water up from the south, keeping the conveyor belt in motion and connecting surface and deep ocean currents. The AMOC plays a crucial role in regulating Earth's climate. By transporting heat from the equator to the poles, it helps balance temperatures across the globe, making some regions warmer and others cooler. Without the AMOC, the tropics would become even hotter, while the northern latitudes would plunge into much colder conditions. The difference would be dramatic, affecting weather, agriculture, and even the way people live. Today, scientists are closely monitoring the AMOC, and they're finding troubling signs. Evidence suggests that this vital circulation is weakening, raising concerns about the future of our climate. One major reason is the rapid melting of Greenland's ice sheet. As more fresh water pours into the North Atlantic, it dilutes the salty ocean water, making it less dense and less likely to sink. This slows down the entire conveyor belt. With less warm water reaching the north, a cold anomaly, known as the cold blob, has formed in the North Atlantic. This is a direct result of the AMOC slowdown, and it's a clear signal that something is changing. The effects don't stop there. Changes in the AMOC ripple through the entire climate system influencing weather patterns, storm tracks, and even rainfall across continents. The cold blob is more than just a patch of chilly water. It's a visible warning sign of a disrupted climate system, and a hint of what could come if the AMOC continues to weaken. That's why understanding the health of the AMOC is so important. By tracking its changes, scientists hope to predict how our climate might shift in the coming decades. If the conveyor belt continues to slow, winters in Europe and North America could become harsher and the impacts could last for generations. The story of the AMOC is a reminder of how deeply connected our oceans are to life on land. So, how does a cold patch in the Atlantic change your weather? It might seem far away, but this chilly spot in the ocean can have surprising effects, reaching all the way to your doorstep. Let's break down how this works. The ocean and atmosphere are always interacting. When a large area of ocean water becomes colder than usual, it cools the air above it. This cooling effect causes the air to become denser and heavier, which leads to the formation of a high-pressure system right over the cold patch. This high-pressure block acts like a barrier, disrupting the normal flow of weather systems. It's especially influential on the jet stream, which is a fast-moving river of air high above us that steers storms and weather patterns. The jet stream, which usually flows smoothly from west to east, is forced to bend and twist around the high-pressure block. This creates big looping waves in its path, which can dramatically alter weather far downstream. When the jet stream dips far to the south, it opens the door for frigid Arctic air to surge deep into North America. 
This can trigger intense cold snaps, blizzards, and heavy snowfall, transforming cities into winter wonderlands almost overnight. On the other hand, when the jet stream bulges northward, it allows warm air from the south to move in. This can bring unexpected thaws, milder temperatures, and even rain in the middle of winter, making for a season of wild contrasts. Sometimes, the cold blob can lock the jet stream into a stubborn pattern that lasts for weeks or even months. This persistent setup can set the stage for the entire winter, determining whether it will be stormy, snowy, or unusually mild. The chain reaction starts with melting Arctic ice, which slows down a major ocean current called the Amok. This slowdown helps create the cold blob, which then goes on to shape the jet stream and in turn, our weather. This cascade of events can mean a winter of wild swings, frigid and stormy in some places, mild and calm in others. The result is a season full of surprises, with weather that can change dramatically from week to week. The cold blob's influence stretches from the icy Arctic all the way to your backyard, affecting what you wear, how you travel, and even your daily routines. It's a powerful example of how distant changes in the world's oceans can shape the weather you experience at home, reminding us just how connected our planet systems truly are. The Pacific Ocean also plays a huge role in North American weather. One key pattern is the Pacific North American Pattern, or PNA, which has positive and negative phases. In a positive PNA, high pressure builds over the west coast, blocking storms and bringing warmth, while a trough in the east invites cold Arctic air. The Atlantic Cold Blob can help lock in a positive PNA, reinforcing this east-west weather split. It's a domino effect. High pressure in the Atlantic supports a trough in the east and a ridge in the west. These teleconnections show how distant climate patterns interact. The cold anomaly and PNA together could make a positive PNA more likely and persistent this winter. That means a strong east-west divide in temperatures. The Atlantic and Pacific are working together to shape the season. So, what could winter 2025 to 2026 look like? With the cold blob and a likely positive PNA, forecasters expect a dramatic east-west split. The west, British Columbia to California, could see a warmer, drier winter with less snow and potential water shortages. Meanwhile, the east, Midwest, Great Lakes, Northeast, and Eastern Canada could face a colder, snowier season. Arctic air will have an easier path south, increasing the risk of snowstorms and cold snaps. These are broad patterns, not daily guarantees, there will still be variability. The west might get cold spells and the east could see mild days. But overall expect a high contrast winter with wild jet stream swings. The setup could make this a memorable season for millions. The stage is set for a classic winter weather showdown. The North Atlantic cold anomaly isn't acting alone this winter. This vast region of unusually cold water, sometimes called the cold blob, is just one piece of a much larger puzzle shaping our seasonal weather. In the Pacific, La Nina, the cool phase of the El Nino Southern Oscillation, or ENSO, may be developing. This global climate driver brings its own set of influences, sending ripples through weather patterns far beyond the Pacific Basin. La Nina winters are known for bringing wetter conditions to the Pacific Northwest, with frequent rain and storms. At the same time, colder air tends to spill into the northern United States, setting the stage for snow and icy conditions. If La Nina's influence lines up with the North Atlantic cold blob, the two could reinforce each other. This powerful combination increases the likelihood of a cold, snowy winter for the eastern U.S., with the potential for major snowstorms and prolonged cold snaps. Meanwhile, the Atlantic Meridional Overturning Circulation, or AMOC, is slowing down over the long term. This massive ocean current acts like a conveyor belt, and its slowdown helps anchor the cold blob in place, making its effects more persistent and widespread. And then there's the polar vortex, a swirling mass of frigid air that circles the Arctic. When stable, it keeps the cold locked up north, but it can be disrupted. A wavier jet stream, shaped by both the cold blob and La Nina, can weaken the polar vortex. This allows lobes of Arctic air to plunge southward, bringing sudden and severe cold to regions unaccustomed to such extremes. As a result, the odds of Arctic outbreaks, those blasts of bone-chilling air, rise for the eastern U.S. and Canada. Cities could see temperatures drop rapidly, with snow and ice storms following close behind. 
all these factors are converging, pointing toward a winter of dramatic contrasts. Some areas may experience relentless cold and snow, while others could see milder, even spring-like spells, sometimes just a few hundred miles apart. The interplay between ocean and atmosphere is more dynamic than ever, setting the stage for unpredictable and powerful weather events. This coming winter could become a showcase of climate forces in action, with each system amplifying the effects of the others in real time. Stay tuned as we watch a season unfold, shaped by some of the most powerful global patterns on the planet. The story of this winter is just beginning. Let's look at the recipe for this wild winter. The main ingredient, the North Atlantic cold anomaly, driven by a slowing amok, warping the jet stream. Add a potential La Nina, which also favors a wavy jet stream and cold air in the east. Combine these and you get a powerful synergy. Each amplifies the other's effects. Sprinkle in the risk of a disrupted polar vortex, which can unleash the coldest Arctic air. Together, these ingredients create a high-impact winter cold and stormy in the east, warm and dry in the west. Each factor reinforces the others, making the forecast more confident. It's a dramatic example of how climate patterns can align for a memorable season. This winter could be one for the record books. After all this, remember, this is a forecast, not a guarantee. Seasonal predictions are based on trends and probabilities, not certainties. Many things could change. La Nina might weaken, the cold blob could shift, or other patterns could override the forecast. The atmosphere is chaotic, and surprises are always possible. Forecast models are sophisticated but not perfect. Different models can show different outcomes. The outlook we've shared is the most likely scenario but alternatives are always on the table. Use this forecast as a guide, not gospel. It's helpful for planning but don't make irreversible decisions based on it. Stay informed and be ready for a range of possibilities. The only sure thing about weather is that it will change. The big takeaway? Earth's climate is dynamic and interconnected. The North Atlantic cold anomaly shows how distant changes can shape your daily weather. Scientists will be watching how this feature and La Nina evolve in the coming months. As winter approaches, forecasts will get more detailed, so keep an eye on updates from trusted sources like NOAA or Environment Canada. This is a chance to be a science citizen, notice patterns, ask questions, and stay curious. Understanding the jet stream or polar vortex gives you a deeper appreciation for the weather. Whether this winter is historic or just another season, the science behind it is fascinating. Observation and data help us prepare for what's ahead. So, as winter nears, keep learning and stay curious. Our world is full of surprises, and there's always more to discover. Stay tuned for what nature has in store.